Hey guys, back, back, back with another message. I actually want to give, we're going to do this love thing. We're going to try to do this love thing, right? Guys, go get your water. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. We're going to see what's going on in the love department. I have the light seers and then I have the romance angel. And we'll see what's happening in love. I hope you guys are all doing well. This is a healing channel, no judgment zone. So I'm not sugarcoating nothing. I'm speaking the truth. And if that is something that triggers, I support you in that energy if you click off. But if you continue to stay, I definitely, I am appreciative of that. And thank you, thank you, thank you. Don't forget to like the video, share, subscribe. It helps the algorithm so others can get these messages as well. All right. Always take what resonates, leave what doesn't, you know, and then if it doesn't resonate, it may resonate at another time. My videos are always timeless. So, you know, check back in, you know, maybe you guys are just rocking with me and you like my energy and I appreciate the energy exchange. I really, really do. I love you guys. All right. We're going to tap into what some of these love messages are. Indifferent <laughs> or, or otherwise, I don't know what's happening, what's happening, what's happening because there's some breakups happening, there's some separations happening, you know, there's some turmoils, there's some things that's going on. Yeah, I want to just start flying everywhere. First card out the deck is the world card. That seems to be the theme right now. So Whatever's going on, indifferent or not, there's going to be there's going to be a significant change that is happening in a connection. Uh, somebody's birthday could be on the 21st or on the 12th. Somebody could be seeing the number 212. All right, so somebody really is just wanting to do something new, try something new maybe in the connection, even if the connection is long term. Somebody is just like, listen, the, the way we doing this ain't, ain't it, right? So somebody's possibly considering going to, oh, wow. Somebody's considering going to, like, counseling, therapy, counseling, getting some sort of mentor. The Wheel of Fortune, Mo moving forward. Somebody is like, listen, either, either you growing with me, either we doing this the right way and bringing things in balance, we hearing each other out. We're doing this like two mature civil adults or, or, or we not. All right. So somebody is really serious in, in the department of love, of, of wanting and knowing their worth, that you deserve to have a healthy relationship, that you shouldn't have to settle or compromise. 6-10, June 10th. Uh, I'm hearing somebody is considering opening up a, a Lamaz clinic in the, in the community. Okay. Six of Cups. King of Wands and the Strength card. Mm. So you have this King of Wands really, you know, the, this leader type energy. Like you, you're looking for somebody who is a leader. You know, somebody who is strong, who, who could take charge. You know, you got, because you see the lion in the background and then you see she's half lion, right? So the, the two personalities, very, very, um, very two alphas. <laughs> so two people, a uh, female Leo and a male Leo, you know, Really, power couple really could be taking on the world. Really could be doing something, you know, really strong together. So this might be a new connection. This could be a new connection. Somebody new from their childhood. This could be a reunion. Um, somebody from the childhood. Or there's children that, that are connected into uh, this this connection, this, this powerhouse. Somebody really, or somebody's, I'm, I'm hearing, wanting to work with children. What's this 
King of Wands. Let's see. Spirit, who is this King of Wands? What's his energy? All right, so this King of Wands is really feeling like um, that you can, you can tame them. So where the balance is here, okay, Spirit is getting me to stop for a second because there's, there's a lot of, let me put these down before I drop everything. Do you see how she's balancing herself in that circle? There's a balance right here in the, in the Six of Pentacles and then she's balancing herself on the wheel. All right, so in order for this love connection to work out, a balance has to happen. But I'm also picking up, you're wanting this masculine to take charge, to take the lead, because you've always had to. You've always been in your power. You've always, you have a, 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 a strong voice. You have a strong stature, a strong stance for life, a very strong, maybe a very opinionated. This could, connection could be a past life connection. Or you know that this person, there's a past life connection with this person. You know there's something very, um, very strong about this connection. You feel it. Very, very spiritual. This King of Wands also could want children. Maybe right now you're like, listen, can we just start with a pet? <laughs> can we just start? Can we just start with the animal? For okay, I'm not comparing a pet obviously to a child. All right, I'm not doing that. But um, somebody, I see the two of cups. So there's a lot of love here. There's a lot of love here. Um, a lot of unconditional love here. Definitely, uh, if this is new, this is there's so much potential here. All right, if this is a connection that has been in turmoil and if both are doing the work and both are getting the counseling that that you both need, like see both are doing both are doing this, right? It's not it's not one is leaning on the other, one is not blaming the other. This is a beautiful connection right here. This is this is this is like what you call like uh, emotional intelligence. This is this is like what your epiphany of, you know, what a good, healthy, strong, passionate, stable relationship is. It's a lot of, it's a lot of fire here. Yes, it is. <laughs> With the Knight of Wands. Okay, so you could be a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be. Uh, but these, these signs could be like heavy in your chart or heavy in, in your person's chart. You know, you just, you have this spunk to you. You have this fierceness. You have this fire. You know, you have this fire that cannot be put out. And it's it's matching, it is literally matching this masculine's energy. You know, so in, in some essence, that's why it has to be balanced. Because you know what? What happens when you put too much fire together, right? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm not trying to burn down the house, but listen, it is, it's okay because, look, you got the two of cups, so you, you got that water, that water and fire do, do make steam, all right? So there's a lot of balance that is here in this connection. I really like this. I really like this energy. All right, Spirit, tell us more. Tell us more collectively for this love connection. Ooh, they're going to just keep dropping. I'm going to have some videos at my other uh, workstation, um, you know, this this is early, early, early morning. So I just wanted to come on and um, be able to greet you guys properly. Oh. We had the high priestess, high priestess here. Yeah, so um, you actually could work with fire magic. You and this person could work with fire magic. Could be a Pisces, seven of wands. Yeah, you you are needing to be, there's a lot of confidence here. A lot of confidence here, right? A highly spiritual woman. Um, there, there really is no getting anything past you. So the, the masculine that, that you are with or this masculine that is coming in, he has to have confidence to be a part of that world. He could be as well. Oh, I really like this. So somebody is that works on their chakras, 
You could be some sort of empath, some sort of healer, starseed, light worker. Very in tune, meditated, very tapped into to nature. Almost have like um like a past life of um like Woodstock, like a hippie type of energy. Maybe not in this, like that um uh, bohe bohemian, you know, like a bohemian energy. Even if you don't look like it, you you may have like the spirit of a bohemian energy. Like you you're not letting anybody, you know, individuals tell you you can't do something. You like, well, listen, let me let me pray and let me meditate on it. All right, I worry about you. I'm gonna worry about me. So definitely a lot of confidence here. Very tapped in. I'm picking up that it's, it's maybe hard for you to um, get in a lot, get in love connections. You may have not been in a love connection in a long time, or if this is somebody, if you have been in a, in a long connection, it's taking your partner a long time to kind of really see you. Like they really, it's really you know, especially if you got together at. Uh, high school, uh, college sweethearts, you've grown over the years in, into your being a woman, even if this is vice versa. Somebody is now seeing their mate for the first time, even if this is like years later. Page of Cups. This person, listen, somebody is really, really, really in love with you really in love with you this i'm picking up as a separate energy um that you don't know who this is so this is there's different scenarios right there's different scenarios because i'm not doing a one-on-one -on -one and everybody can't be going through the same thing at at once right that doesn't make sense there's another energy that is here right there's this water energy so he could be pisces cancer or scorpio he has an immense I don't know if you can see that. He has immense, you know, vibration, love um, coming from his heart. So you may even be picking up like heart palpitations where you just start feeling heart palpitations out of nowhere. You could be picking up on this person's energy. They're not really, um, they're not, they're not saying it, but they're, they're feeling it, right? So you have, listen, you may even have two, okay, you may have two suitors. So one who is a fire energy, doesn't have to be a fire sign. These are just energies, right? One who has that fire energy, where they're more passionate, they're more aggressive with letting you know that they're into you. Then you may have somebody that is a little bit more, they, they could be a little bit more sensitive, hypersensitive. They could be a little bit more shy. This person has so much love to give. They may be afraid to actually express that. They may be afraid to give that type of love. Because uh, somebody is like, you know, uh, that, that energy, well, I'll fall in love when, or I'll get that, that perfect mate when pigs fly. So there may be a combination where this masculine may need to be more in, you know, a, a more sensitive side. All right. Maybe, maybe not so much, you know, outwardly, maybe not so much ag uh, aggressive, like, your mind, your mind, and, and there's, there's really, you know, there's a lot of passion, but somebody may need to, or want to hear like the actual words, right? So you may have, let me put this down. You may have somebody that is, you know, listen, he, th this is very passionate, right? He knows what he wants. He gets what he wants. This one right here, right? And then this one right here is more of the 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 verbal one he wants to express himself verbally so you know this could potentially be the balance that that you're looking for all right so we have bottom of the deck we have the four of cups you know somebody kind of sitting waiting bored waiting for you to somebody's waiting for you to call them somebody's waiting for you to reach out to them Somebody also has a tattoo of an infinity sign or wants a tattoo of the infinity sign. 
this person he can have gray eyes or, or blue eyes with like um brown skin like he he tans really well knight of pentacles somebody i mean somebody could be dragging a situation out taking a little longer or things is taking a little longer than they anticipated and maybe that's what they're bored about different connection diff different situation Somebody thought by now you would have contacted them or you would have, you, you thought by now this person would have contacted you. Why is the four cups here, spirit? What's the four cups? Let's, let's see what the four cups is. Four of swords, four, 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 one, four. Somebody could be 44. One is bored. One is resting. Or needs to rest. Somebody doesn't know if something is even going to work out. Or is it even worth working out. I'm also picking up this energy where. This is a passive aggressive energy. Like somebody expects you to know something's going on with them, but they're not telling you what's going on with them. Four of Swords. What's the Four of Swords? So somebody could be Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. Choosing not to talk. Because those are very communicative type of signs. They don't have a problem saying what they want to say. Not saying that they communicate well, because... They probably don't in, in, in this, you know, they, they wait, they wait for you to say something first. Like they, I'm gonna lay here. I don't know if this person is, is purposely ignoring you. Three of Pentacles or earth energy, you know, so they got time for family and friends. You may, you may know that they're actually returning messages to other individuals but they're leaving they're leaving your messages on red that's energy two of Pentacles yeah trying to juggle trying to juggle this uh situation with the with the three of Pentacles so you could be in this energy of you know I've been doing this for X, Y, however long you've been doing this. I've been trying to figure this out. I've been trying to make this come to balance. I want to go to therapy. You know, at the end of the day, you're going to choose you. You're going to choose you. Five of Pentacles. Damn. Damn. This this is different. definitely. The, whatever this energy that's, that's coming up now is definitely in a more low vibrational type of energy. Right, somebody is just like really contemplating how much more do I do this? How much more do I put my time and emotion into these cups? And all I feel is abandoned and left behind and alone and unheard and unseen. And somebody just like, listen, I, I don't even have the strength to get up. I'm hurt. Somebody's feeling broken. Wow. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Why is the Five of Pentacles here? So the lovers came out sideways, reverse. So Five of Pentacles here is because of lovers, because of a lover. All right. So definitely got some different scenarios here. Devil at the bottom of the deck. Somebody could be addicted to porn. Somebody has some sort of addiction or somebody is addicted to the um, the idea of loving you, but then they don't really want to do the work. So we got the four of wands. Four of wands is definitely the celebratory, right? But it's also um, stable marriage. Uh, the four of wands is a twin flame card as well, if, if that, you know, resonates with, with somebody. But here with this lovers and this devil energy right here, you know, uh, so, so very hot and cold. Very hot and cold, this person is coming in. Again, I feel like this person is addicted to you or addicted to the idea of you. But at having to actually, you know, to actually have to do the, the actual work. 
all right, to really bring in balance, to bring in communication, to bring in honesty, uh, to, you know, to even to even be vulnerable, to be vulnerable, right? The inner the inner child healing, all right. This is what you're looking for, that type of balance. All right, you're gonna get it. This person, if they if they was to remain in this energy, if somebody remains in this low vibrational energy, because with the devil and with the lovers is just lust. So this 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 is not this is not love here. This is not love here. And somebody is just like, yeah, nah, um, I'm walking away. I, I thought the eight of no. Nah. Wow, the knight of pentacles, somebody is Somebody walking away, they walking away really slow. You may be having to walk away really slow, especially if you have a child with this person or you have something somewhat established with them, right? This is not just a get up and leave type of energy. I just want to clarify. I want to clarify um, before I get this romance angels. What is the devil here for? So somebody could be dealing with a Capricorn or a Gemini. So there's an energy of a masculine here, always, always putting his hand out, you know, always judgment, always forgive me, you know, I'm going to do better, you know, I'm trying, I didn't have a good childhood, this happened to me, my father did this, my mother did this, you know, I'm just hearing, and somebody is just like, listen, I just want an adult, I just want an adult relationship. Somebody could be from Indonesia, with the Philippine. Somebody has strong roots in um, Italy. Somebody should learn Chinese magic, Italian magic. You could have met this person in 2015. I'm saying definitely something significant with tattoos, all right? Somebody could be a tattoo artist, a makeup artist. All right, these this one kind of fell out, but I, now I got to get to this shit because the magician came out. Somebody doing, somebody doing some damn sex magic. Somebody doing some love spells. Oh, boy, here we go with this dumbass shit because you know what? It backfires every single time. All right, so somebody's trying to manifest you back in, not in a healthy way. If you, if somebody has removed themselves, you've healed yourself from these um, inner wounds, from these abandoned issues, from somebody uh, is needing. So there's some sort of illness. Somebody got some. Somebody got an illness. Somebody needs to go and. Um, a drinking problem, a sex addiction, a porn addiction. I already, I already picked that up. Somebody caught somebody um, being cheated on. I don't know. Somebody came home and caught somebody else in their house. Especially if, if listen, if this is somebody that the person knows, if this is you and you know that person, they tried to make it like, oh, well, she just came over waiting for you but shit felt funny shit looked funny shit smelled funny don't let them think don't let them make you like like you crazy or something like that all right these somebody's doing somebody that you know this could even be a family member doing something that you know behind your back purposely all right they trying to deny it it's that's that's some crazy ass okay i don't even want to be in that energy turn that return that shit back Return it back to sender, right? Take a spiritual bath if you feel that somebody did um, like a, a sex spell on you, all right? I just want to try to clear that energy a little bit. Let's see from the romance angels. Romance angels, what do we have for the collective? Please and thank you. Thank you, beloved. Thank you. What do we have? For the collective engagement your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment so listen you've 
you leaving all those toxic relationships behind. You did a wonderful job. You've been tested. You're going to continue to get tested. Unfortunately, sometimes the devil likes to come hard right before that success, right before uh, that, that love is coming in just to pull you right back down and make you feel like you're not uh, worthy or deserving. So, so there is a, uh, there is a engagement that is happening, right? So you may have these other individuals that is jealous about that. They, they try to make you feel like that was never going to happen for you. Pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. All right. So this is going to be about those friends. This is going to be about those friends. Maybe just have a little small intimate wedding. All of that. Having six, seven um, bridesmaids. And one of them bridesmaids want to sleep with this man. So. Or, you know, somebody may have to put an engagement off for a little while if they're suspicious of something. You know, not being so fucking eager to be called a wife or a husband. Really, I'm going to say wife. Not being so eager that... That somebody don't look at the red flags and you're about to get into a, ma a marriage and find out that this person got sex addictions and they've been sleeping with your girlfriends this whole entire time. I have to speak the truth. That's how spirit is doing it. It says, let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. All right. So listen, go within, heal yourself. You could only control your emotions and your actions at this time, but keep your fucking eyes open. Um, to what these situations are, especially pay attention to your dreams. Guys, I'm going to see you into the next video. I'm going to see you into whatever. <laughs> I'm going to see you in the next video. Take care of yourself and each other. Peace.